Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I'm wearing a tank top again, all right? It's hot out, leave me alone. So today we're working on the Subaru because you know I've been working on this car in a while and there's some uh, small things I wanna do to it. For example, we got this little piece of silver trim here that I've always just kind of left alone and I feel like I may as well just wrap it, complete the look of the car a little bit more. Eventually I'll wrap kind of this section here behind the side skirt because that's kind of a prevalent silver there. But for now, we'll just leave it because I gotta take the whole side skirt off in order to wrap behind there. So we'll just leave that for now and wrap just that small bit there. That's what it looks like now. I'd say it's it's definitely cleaner. It really does complete the wrap. These fog light covers, which I'm going to also wrap in purple and then probably put lines around it. Plus, they're easy to take off and work with, so should just pop off just like that. It's the same thing with this side. If I can pull the damn thing off. And there we go. You know, I've always wondered why these were never color matched. Uh, silver with the rest of the car, because when I bought it, obviously this car was silver, and these were black, and usually these are color matched. I've only just figured it out, look. If I'm not mistaken, that's the writing they usually give you when you pick up parts from a junkyard. They usually put these little markings on the back of it. So I guess this is a junkyard piece from another uh, Impreza or even a WRX, which, huh, that's kind of interesting to me. So since it is summer, there are bugs flying around everywhere. So there's some bug guts and other dirt sitting on these. So just gotta clean them up and then we'll do the wrap. The front end is reassembled. I'll quickly show you what it looks like right now. We have to take them off again because, as you can see, the rest of the car is Tron wrapped, but then this isn't. So we're gonna put kind of an outline around here on, on the actual bumper, and then in here, kind of outlining kind of this little inside section. And to do that, I have this section of wrap here. It's a pretty small piece, so. Man, I sound so bored here. What am I doing? Should be good. I think this is a five by two. It's not very large, so. Yeah, I'm just gonna open it up, cut some pieces, and then I have to dry out the bumble too, but that's okay. Okay, this is just the outline around there. I think it looks pretty good. Compared to the other side, definitely looks more complete. So we're gonna go ahead, do the rest of these sections, and 
yeah, we'll see what it looks like at the end. Okay, all right, well, everything is done now. Everything is complete. I haven't just worked on the front. I've done a little bit on the back as well. So we'll, I'll show you the back first and then the front. So there's not much, but I'll see if you can tell the difference. I'll give you three more seconds. Three, two, one. It's the tail lights and the, the, this part of the bumper as well. Main focus here are the tail lights because if you, uh, I won't show this one actually, this one's cracked. This one, you can see there's kind of three ish sections of these tail lights, and then you got the little circle bit for the reverse light as well. And these tails are kind of split into three sections, so I thought, hey, why not outline the three sections on the tail lights? And, you know, it could look cool. I think it looks nice. Also, I find it really cool, the design of this car, because the tail light, this part of the tail light here, follows the bumper. Like right there. I find that quite interesting. Oh yeah. I also outline this down here. That's the left side. And that's the right side. I've done the outline on the actual bumper itself rather than doing it on this inside section here. And I've done all the outlinings on the inside. So we have a little piece there. There's one up here as well around the actual fog light itself, and then one that goes kind of behind there. That's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed, if you did, go ahead, leave a like, comment below, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Um, we can't drive the Miata right now because it's kind of raining on and off. Right now it's not raining. As you can see, it has been raining. If you look here on the cars, and then the cover here, and it's wet yeah i always do this i always ramble at the end of the videos let me stop doing it see you in the next video goodbye